All right, all right, all right. We're back. It is Burrito Bandito Burrito Review time again. And I am the Burrito Bandito. You might know me as the Sexy Mexi, Forest Grove's favorite son, uh, El Guapo. Uh, but we're here. We are at Savoya Taqueria in Portland, continuing our Portland Redemption Tour. 4438 Gleason. And uh, we're going to see what we see here today. Um, beautiful weather today. Not too bad. Looking, looking good. Things are prosperous right now. Uh, first off, 975. 975. Pretty good price. You know, we're going to see here, see what all that, what all goes into that. Um, feels pretty good. Let's see here. Uh -huh. All right. We are in pounds. Ooh. Get in here, little bandito. 1.20. So we're we're in that we're in that nice little range there. Um, but yeah, so oh oh and the little FYI, um, some people well actually several people were messaging me a while back. They're saying uh, um, don't be so hard on Fox 12, um, you know because obviously they're the ones that kicked off this whole tour uh, because of the disservice they did to uh, with the reviews that they did. But, um, you know, I'll say this. Um, I got nothing against those guys. <laughs> you know, uh, it's all in good fun. Um, if you grow up in the culture that I grew up in, everybody had nicknames, everybody jokes. Um, but from the bottom of my heart, I have no ill will towards Fox 12. Um, they're like the uh, the little kid that's helping you work on a project at home. You know, they run around with tools and uh, they kind of, they, they hit stuff, you know, and uh, maybe every once in a while they're helpful, uh, but they're just fun to look at and it's nice. Uh, it's, it's nice that they're trying to help. Um, and I will commend them for that. They got people's names out here. Um, and that's really what we're all about. So, that being said, let's see what the K-Bar has to say about this burrito. All right, let's flip this over so I don't get so much paper. Um, looks pretty good. Um, there's definitely beans and a little bit of rice for sure. Uh, Bean Bandito, what do you want, left or right? Right. The right side. He wants that side. All right. All right, I will respect your wishes as a scholar and a gentleman because there are very few of us left. Uh, ooh, little tape. Smells good. Um, and this place is pretty cool, actually. You'll see the pictures on Instagram when I post them. Um, but uh, it's like a full-on market. So the taqueria part is just a, is a little section, but you can get... Uh, drinks, food, beer, wine, whatever you need here at this place. And, uh, oh yeah, get a shot of this uh, little bandito um, of the entrance. And then there's picnic tables there. Um, cool place to sit. And uh, I'm sure this place is kicking during uh, summertime when the weather's really good. Um, looks like a good hangout spot. So I'm going to come in hot and let it wobble. All right? Thank you very much also to the couple that gave me this shirt. Uh, some bandito fans made it for me so thank you very much um, but yeah nothing else to do Don't fall over, baby bandito. He's hopping up and down on the curb. I like how he's using the curb this week because it's kind of short, so making it work. Um, hmm. The flavor, it's got everything right. The ratios are actually pretty good with the rice and beans. Very little, not too much, but um, 
the flavor for me is just not there. It needs a little more, um, I don't know, either seasoning or marinade with the meat. Um, but it's pretty good. I mean, not, not bad. I wouldn't, I wouldn't travel all the way into Portland, um, to get it. But if I lived in the area, heck yeah. Um, let's go seven, one, seven, one, you know, it's a decent little neighborhood burrito, especially if you're coming in here for drinks or, um, bag of chips or whatever, you know, some ice in the summertime. Um, you know, come on out and check them out. Saoyo Taqueria on 4438 Gleason. So uh, remember, I am the Burrito Bandito, and you're not, and that's our review. 100% Great Grandma approved.